the Bodhisattva returns. He looks different now, stronger, with more energy. A stranger collecting grass kneels to the ground. On his knees, he offers the Bodhisattva a bundle of grass. Heavenly angels start to sing. Purple water lilies and other flowers fall like rain from the sky. There is the smell of incense in the air. I can see strength in the Bodhisattva's eyes as he comes near me. He looks around and sprinkles some grass on the ground. Magically, a wonderful seat appears. The Bodhisattva sits down with his legs crossed, facing east where the sun will rise. Angels celebrate with more singing, and the forest looks beautiful. Suddenly, it becomes dark. Blackness is covering the sky. A lightning explodes and shakes the ground. A terrible voice screams out. So this Prince Siddhartha wishes to escape from my world? He will fail. All at once, heavy rain pours from the black sky. My branches quickly reach down to protect the Bodhisattva. But he's not afraid. And magically, we are not wet from the thunderstorm. More terrible sounds scream out from behind the curtain of rain. It's Mara, the evil one, riding Girmakala, the monster. Behind them are many, many angry demons ready to attack the Bodhisattva. They launch fiery rocks into the air. A sea of arrows race into the sky above. But look, the flaming rocks and arrows turn into flowers. They fall gently to the ground. The demons rush forward to attack with their swords and their axes. But their weapons turn into flowers too as they fall to the ground. Mara punches into the air shouting, Get up! You cannot sit there! I am king! I give people all they desire. I am the giver. I should sit there. Pointing to his demons, he continues. They are my witnesses. What have you given to others? Do you have any witness? The Bodhisattva slowly touches the ground with his finger. And the earth responds with a mighty quake. Mara falls down. A voice from the earth says, I am his witness. A beautiful goddess appears from the ground and bows to the Bodhisattva. She says, Yes, I am Mother Earth. And I have seen in his previous life, a hundred times, a thousand times, his hands, eyes, head, and his entire body he gave to help others. She turns to Mara and says, He is better than you in loving kindness, generosity, and strength. The goddess twists her long, beautiful hair, and a river bursts out of it. All the water of offerings from the Bodhisattva's previous life pours out to blood and wash away Mara and his demons. The forest becomes quiet and peaceful. The Bodhisattva continues his meditation beneath my crown of heart-shaped leaves. Suddenly, bright rays appear from his body. Blue rays, yellow, red, white and orange gloriously light up the night. The Bodhisattva is now a Buddha, a supreme enlightened being and I have become the tree of enlightenment, the Bodhi tree.
जाए 